Hey YouTubers, it's Ken from KBD Productions TV. Welcome back to another Thirsty Thursdays just for you. Today I'm trying the Starbucks uh, Frappuccino coffee drink. I've been wanting to try these for a while. I see them always sitting there and they're taunting me. There's like three or four flavors and uh, just today was the day. I saw it, I grabbed it, and I want to review it just for you. Never had it before. Uh, this is kind of something I might buy possibly. Is it, it was two dollars and uh, I put the bill down somewhere. There it is. It was $2.99 and after the taxes it was three dollars and forty cents. So a large coffee uh, in Canada is about a dollar ninety to two bucks. So possibly on a hot day, you don't want a hot beverage, you might want to grab one of these. I don't know yet. Let's open it up and see. Uh, it is 290 calories. It's got sugar. It's got sodium. It's got carbohydrates. It's got everything the growing body wants. <laughs> Let's open it up. It's got a special safety seal on it. The best thing about it, it looks like the old fashioned milk um, containers, milk jars, jugs. All right, I shook it up in the store too. It looked like it was, oh, there we go, look at that. Interesting. Okay, let's give it a shot. Oh, it smells good. Ooh, I'm expecting it to be a cross between chocolate milk and a coffee, but on the sweet side. And I am 100% correct. Although I'm starting to get an aftertaste. Is it a good aftertaste? Mm. It has a bit of, I didn't say, did it say, okay. I'm going to say it tastes a little bit like caramel, but it doesn't say it on the front. It says it on the back. Caramel. That was funny. I'm like, hmm. It's a cross between chocolate, coffee, but I'm tasting something else. And it was caramel. Let's give it another shot. It is rich. It's almost thick. If you were to compare that to anything else, it's, it's a thick drink. Um, it definitely has that bitter coffee aftertaste. It's kind of lingering around a little bit, a little bit too long maybe. You definitely need a breath mint after this if you're going to go to talk with somebody. Mm. They have a few more flavors. Uh, it would be interesting to try them all out and uh, let you know which one I thought was the best. But on my rating scale at this point in time, I'm going to possibly go, hmm, I, I was going to say, again, between a, a uh, indifferent and a would recommend. I would recommend this if you love Frappuccino, if you love caramel. It's not bad. It definitely has a bit of an aftertaste to it. But I can't wait to try the other ones and see if they have an after, aftertaste as well. All right, guys, I hope you liked this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Ding, 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 ding. And we'll see you next time on another Kendomic Thirsty Thursdays. Talk to you later. Cheers. Hey, YouTubers. Hey, YouTubes. Hey, YouTube. It's Ken from KBD. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Talk to you later. Bye.